You fainted, baby. That's what happened. I was coming upstairs to check on you, and then you were laying in the bathtub. Yeah, baby, you fainted. Did you not eat or something? Here, let me grab you some water. But if we talked about this, you need to eat and you need to drink your water. Here you go. Drink up, please. There we go. Oh, baby. Here. Let me help you up. No, are you okay? Don't, don't lean that way. Come towards me. Yeah, there you go. Alright, let's walk over here. To the bed. Lay down, baby. Oh, let me open the window so you could get some fresh air. And this fan on. Here, baby, don't move. I need to check your head to see if you got hurt anywhere. Mm. Okay, that looks fine. Ooh, you got a little bruise there. We might need to go to the hospital, babe. Oh, baby, my love. You have to eat. I know. Listen, babe. Even if you don't feel hungry, or you're not in the mood to eat, at least eat, like, some crackers or something, or, or some eggs. If you don't like eggs, um, maybe some bread. But you have to eat something, babe. You have to. I know you feel a bit weak right now. So please don't move, okay? I don't want you to fall over. Here, let me get you some crackers. And something to my junk. Eat up, babe. Good job. Here, another one. Great work. I'm so proud of you. Let me kiss your forehead. so worried when I saw you laying on the floor. I almost started freaking out. 
but I'm happy that you're okay. And it wasn't like anything like worse or something. Uh, I was about to call like my mom. I didn't know what to do at first. But then when you opened your eyes, I was relieved. My love, you have to take care of yourself. I love taking care of you as well, but when I'm not around, like when I'm at work and stuff, I need you to make sure that you're eating properly so that you won't faint. Oh. You felt the humidity in the shower made you feel worse. Okay. Well, um, next time maybe open the window in the bathroom if you want a really hot shower or, um, maybe don't scorching hot water on <laughs> I don't know I was so scared babe I'm so happy that you're awake though here let me get you some stuff to treat your wound This might sting a little, but... Okay, I'm sorry. I'll go slower. There we go. Is that okay? Alright. And here's the band-aid. There we go, baby. We should go to the hospital once you feel better, okay? I want to make sure that you don't have a concussion or something. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was going to say concussion. You know, you know that meme. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh. Um. Yeah, yeah, the meme is like, you almost gave me a concussion. Okay, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll stop. But. <clears throat> I love you, babe. And I just want the best for you. Here, we should get you dressed. Uh. This outfit or this outfit? I like this one because it's like, you know, that khaki. It's really in now. Or that cream color. Or this all black one. This one? Okay, cool. Here you go. Put your arms up. There we go. And your pants. There we go. Alright, babe. Just lay down. Drink some more water. And eat more crackers, babe. I'm gonna be right here, right next to you. Alright? Do not fall asleep though. It's very dangerous to fall asleep after you fainted. But I just want to make sure that you're not too loopy to stand up, okay? 
Okay. You're so strong. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna make you a whole feast so that you can eat a lot when you feel better. Okay? Are you happy with that? <laughs> 